the second box, which is a Japanese box, and it's a uh, another document type box, a larger one. Uh, this one was made probably in the 19th century, but very unusual. So here's a first look at it, and uh, you get the idea that the uh, dramatic uh, impressions that they want you to see are often very vivid. This one's done in a really bright orange, which was not really used that much, but was in the later period, such as contemporarily now and uh, turn of last century, which is when this piece was made. Um, it is just typically a one type of a box. Uh, let me kind of show you the rest of it. It just goes over to the area and it ends up uh, being the same kind of a design. And uh, that's basically what you got. Now, the inside, I'll get down to that. Lid comes off. You then have a second tray in this particular one, which is all done in the inside in orange. And there's no design. However, the lid, as I told you sometimes, has a design in it. And there it is. It's a nice, pretty design that uh, is similar to the outside work, same thing. And uh, these are not uncommon. They use these for documents and writing and whatnot. It's something that you do see occasionally uh, in, in, uh, in stores and whatnot. So this is the kind of thing you need to be looking for. Again, the key to all of this is quality, condition, condition, condition. That will make them unique in your collection. If they're badly damaged and you want to go ahead and get them at a very inexpensive price to just look at the techniques and what's involved, you may do so. If they're badly damaged or minorly damaged, they can be repaired. But I will warn you that it's very expensive and usually it's not that great unless it's sent back to Japan where the lacquer makers work on it. So trying to have it repaired here in the U.S. by guys that will say, yes, I can repair that. I would not try it. Now, I have several that I use, and I could recommend them maybe, but stay away from that. Just get them in as good a condition as you can possibly get them for your own collection uh, to, to enjoy them that way.